Hey there, how here? Playing some more sim airport today. And today we are going for some expansions and maybe some more research. We'll see. So I have been collecting a lot of money lately, as you can see, three millions. Yeah, we had like twenty k or something when the last episode ended. And since I built some more things and I have expanded our area and everything. We really haven't been making that much money. So, what I want to do is, I want to just remove this runway, this gate, and just start expanding from the top and see where it takes us. So, let's go on with that. And when I finish with that, I think I will come back and continue. Yeah. And after some time, we're back. As you can see, I have done a lot, a lot of things. I have added two extra large gates, and they're all on the second floor. But as you can see, as with every company that has been grown too fast, we have a lot of problems. I should dismantle that. I forgot that. And the first problem is the baggage, as always. We really need to do work on that baggage claim, Mary, because the baggage is being loaded a long time after all the passengers have came, and also it requires two cars to be loaded. So yeah, it is causing some problems. The other thing, also the baggage, but the baggage that is being unloaded. I have no idea why it is being piled up like this. Maybe the game is just lagging, or maybe we need the things that are like, can you see them? Like these baggage cur cursors, because if we don't, maybe that uh, the baggage just stays in here, because nobody can know if uh, someone is coming to pick them up, or if they're just left there, so... Yeah, we sh definitely will work on that, but these extra large gates are generating a lot of money, as you can see, we had like 7,000 earning when we just started doing this, and I have hired a lot of people, like uh, 10 more workmen, 6 more staff and everything, and so yeah, they are generating a lot of money, but still, they are causing some problems and for example the security is also started to lag and I guess we'll need to remove this wall and expand the security a little bit better and I'm thinking like maybe expand this lower area for the ticketing and you'll have more space for passengers to just come in and as you can see yeah our retail is also struggling a little bit like the cafe started to be to be filled up, like not in general, but like there is not much space to sp to sit when the big flights come in, and also uh, our what are they? Janitor starting having problems as people start littering, and we need to fix that as well. So yeah, a lot of things to do, but. The most important problem, the baggage claim, because as you can see, the uh, the planes are being are waiting for the baggage to be loaded, and that's why all of these flights, like 50 flights, have been cancelled. But at least we are not having any problems with planes just uh, uh, going in and going out now, because we have three three lanes in there. So yeah. Now the only thing we need to do is the baggage and maybe just maybe we'll expand on that one more extra large gate. But we are also like running low on time to time in here as we only have one runway in there. Like we need to uh, make everything so that 
they don't over start overlapping and I think they already started overlapping and if we had one more runway the same way we one more gate the same way we are adding the other gate we'll need to move by 20 minutes and it's already overlapping with the first one so yeah either I will just make it 10 minutes but I am not sure if that will be causing problems with the runway so yeah I think we'll need to wait to add the next gate before we do that so that we maybe can buy this land and is it just getting more expensive every time I look at it or is it getting bigger I don't know and if we buy this land and if we buy this land and this land yeah, we have a lot of buying to do like if you buy this land and then this land will expand to here and if we buy that we can just have the taxiway going from down there and maybe around in here right yeah we'll see about that so now i will just probably quickly expand the security so that people don't pile up like that and i will come back and do the baggage area with you yeah i was doing the ticketing area and uh, as you can see this is what i meant with having a lot of large planes is causing problems with security so that's why we're uh, making the security area bigger i don't even know if this is just lagging or is drill that many people coming in so let's continue with that so now it's all done I have a security, a ticketing area, and no baggage area, of course. As I said, I'm going to do that on camera, probably. So, what I did is, I added a lot of ID checks, as I did at the start, and I just, like, uh, made them in strips so that people, like, go from this ID check through this corridor and can do, go to any metal detector they want to. So this seemed to be the most efficient way of doing it in the space that we have, considering the fact that we can't expand sideways, but we can expand like vertically. So yeah, our security and ticketing area should be fine for a while. Yeah, I always said it, and it doesn't work out like that. And we can just add another line of baggage, and baggage scanners and mag metal detectors in here, or maybe even another line on the top. So, yeah, we can expand our security easily. And ticketing, we can't really expand it that, that easily, but actually we still can. We can, like, add another some more space in here we have probably i don't know how much this taxiway blocks it but as you can see we have like uh 10 ticketing desks on each side 20 ticketing desks like i don't know how many like 10 uh, ticketing kiosks and so yeah it should be working fine people are going to the LRT platform we built through the last episode so what I was saying is that it is working fine everything is going fine and I have added some garbage bins and everything some restrooms to this side as well so that people don't have to go through security if they want to go to the toilet and we need a toilet up here as well somewhere or maybe in here somewhere but mainly the airport is working fine maybe we can expand the cafe later and everything like there's a lot of things that we can do we can buy this land and like we can have um, the park uh, parking area with this car parking lots and everything maybe you can have a road going from down there oh so, yeah there's a lot of space for expansion but we still have this problem with a lot of flights being cancelled and 
a lot of people actually missing their flights. We don't have the line, so they are missing their flights because they like they don't know when their flights are. We need a lot more flight info displays. As you can see, like people only can see in those blue areas and it's not great. So let's just add a bunch of flight info. Are these the ones people can walk under or are these like the ones where they are standing on the ground. They are standing on the ground, aren't they? Always I thought that that blue thing was their connection to the city, but that's the info sign. Okay, it makes much more sense now. So, for starters, what do we need for the baggage claim area? The first thing we need is the ticketing desks to be able to um, get their baggage and load them onto conveyors and then the conveyors transporting them somewhere and that somewhere will be up here I guess yeah it will be up here and we'll have our like the outdoor area of the baggage in here now since we have these ticketing desks connected to the Conveyors, let's see, conveyor down transit, if we like have a transit down here, we need to have that there, and we also need conveyor down transit in here, but first we need to have some more, um, what is it called, foundation, so now as you can see, we have the conveyor down transitions, we can have them right next to the ticketing desk things but we can have them in here so now uh, the baggage will be just gotten from the ticketing desks moved up here and then the, it will be just dropped down and we'll be getting it from here so if you like have some more conveyor like this it should be taking the baggage and moving it and now we need to have the foundation come here where we'll be using as the baggage claim hub so i will probably just collect some collect up some more money do the same thing to the other uh, side and yeah, I'll see you when we get to the baggage shop. So, I was editing the video while waiting to earn some money, and as you can see, we are not really earning any money. So, I will do what I said that I will never do and apply for a loan. Because I have no idea what to do next. If I don't apply to, for a loan, I think we'll go bankrupt because as you can see, we are earning like the money that we are like we are earning the money that we need to uh, earn in one day, and there are still things going on, and we are losing a lot more money than that actually. So yeah, I think I will apply for a loan and just finish off the baggage area so that we can stop having problems with these flights being cancelled. So let's do that. Interest rate, offer expires in 6 hours. Will I expect that? I accept that. I guess 2.4% interest rate is real though. So let's accept that. Now if we go to the lower floor again and start building the foundation again we should be able to come to here somewhere do I need to like um, have this on the first floor or can I have this underground if I can have that underground it 
would be nice actually. Let's try that. So if you like have a room for it like this, will this be enough? Yeah, it should be enough actually. So if we have that room and um, we wait for the people to come and do that. We should be able to have this package help, which I already mentioned that is just like as you can see sorting the baggage to different places and so uh, then we can just have the outgoing things in here and the baggage area should be working just fine. I probably could have said saved a lot more money if I knew that I could put this underground making it in here somewhere. But yeah now we need two baggage hubs one in here like this or like this like this no like this one in there like that and one in here like this somehow and we'll need to dismantle that wall in here go to conveyor have this conveyor going here this one go like this this one going here and we'll need some more foundation because I don't know how to count so let's just have this foundation here hopefully they will be they will just do that quickly and we can quickly continue with baggage things like uh, first we need to have some roads in here or do roads only work for the other cars okay never mind cancel that project let's just have the baggage thing go into the this baggage depot go into the taxiway like this and let's continue with this dismantle this wall like this is actually why i'm not uh, make, like doing this on camera usually because i'm like super distracted go from one one side of the project to the other side in seconds and so that makes it a little bit hard to understand what i'm doing so basically what i'm doing now is i just need to have these exits i can change them to other things but i don't know we just need to get this to the what is it called this thing baggage depot Requ required connection from baggage hub to a baggage hub must be assigned to an aircraft gate oh i didn't know that i feel like have a medium hangar because we only need the baggage depots for these two gates as they are the only ones causing problems should be able to put them put one in here like this or even like this yeah let's put it like that maybe we'll have tax in here later on and as you can see we have four baggage slots two for ent entrances two for exits i'm thinking like um we need one more baggage hub don't we for that or don't we do we need that don't oh. yeah I'm, I don't know. Let's have some more foundation coming from here like this. I'm going to use up all my money for foundation right now, aren't I? Will the bank give me one more loan? What do you think? Or will they, will they just say, no, you don't know how to use your money? I hope they will give me one more loan. I'm a big I'm a big, big airport. They, sh they should understand that I'm using a lot of money to expand, right? 
at least I'm probably, hopefully, earning some money. I don't really know, but I don't think this counts the maintenance expenses and maintenance expenses are a lot, so I might not be earning money even though it says that I'm earning money. Like, I had 30,000, but it used it for the maintenance, that's why I got a loan. I don't know why I put this baggage hub in here. I could have put it facing the wall. Yet another dumb decision that I made. Okay, so we need this foundation as well for the baggage hub. Let's start just dismantling all of the walls around the place because we need them gone. And I'm kind of, kind of stressing because I'm running low on money again. Yeah. If I start, like, reducing the flights that are being cancelled, and if I don't get any flights cancelled, as you, as you probably know, we have this perfect top bonus where all the flights have taken off, and I haven't taken that in a long time, so... Yeah, I miss those. They really generated a lot of money. So if we have another baggage hub... Why am I even putting another baggage hub? Wait, cancel that project. If I like have a conveyor come from this output like this through the side I should just be able to direct it into this one and since this is an output, right? Wait, is it an output or is it an input? So this is an output. If that's an output, this needs to be an input. Yeah. So we can just change that to consumer. Yeah, and just like that, it should be getting to, that should start working. Let's see. Now, yeah, it says it just needs a connection from my package hub. But that's not easy as the first one we did because we cannot put the conveyor in there. Yeah, cancel that. What we need to do is... We, 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 what do we need to do? Good question. We need to dismantle those, unfortunately. Because we need this one to go from... Wait, we can't get it from there. Or can we? We can probably connect it to this conveyor. Because this conveyor only has four producers and this... How much producers does that, does that count as? I don't know. So we need the foundation in here. Like this. And we need the foundation in here. Like this. And we don't have any money yet. Again. As always. Let's get this conveyor. We could have built this one block shorter, couldn't we have? Yes. <sighs> I'm really using my money for things that I don't need and it's disturbing. So now if we connect this here, I was going to say, we need more money. I need another loan, can you let me? Wow, interest rate 31%. I don't think we have any other choice. So. So, technically, now everything should be working. There was just a baggage in there, wasn't that? Yeah, as you can see, it's working now. Finally. Finally. So, the only thing we need to do is connect this one as well, and we should stop um, having problems with these. As you can see, the baggage tracks are just coming, coming there, and loading them up in here 
also that's a lot more convenient than it was earlier. So now we are all done. As you can see, it doesn't have any marker saying that it can't be working, and the baggage is going around. They are still being the building the conveyor belt. Yeah, and I have connected the two baggage hubs with a two-way conveyor so that uh, the passengers can go to any ticketing desk they want and all the baggage hubs will be connected and all the planes will be connected to them and yeah we'll need to expand this a lot later on when we have more big airplanes and we need to repay our debts so I'm hoping that we won't be having any other problems with the flights being cancelled. I can't really see that because, as you can see, we have like 5,005 5 flights cancelled already, so that. So I can't really track if new flights are being cancelled or not. Maybe I can just wait in here and see if the name cha changes. But yeah, I guess this should be. Alright, this bag shop should be working and we should be earning money again. So, I guess this will be it for this episode. I hope I'll see you later and bye-bye.